And joining me now is Dr. Jeffrey Geller, and he is incoming president-elect. And Dr. Geller, thank you for joining us. My pleasure. Uh, first of all, congratulations on your role as APA's incoming president-elect. And why don't you tell us kind of what you're hoping to accomplish during your year as president? The major thrust is two components. One relates to psychiatrists, one relates to psychiatric patients. So I would like to uh, help psychiatrists be better positioned to take care of psychiatric patients. Uh, and I would like there to be more attention to individuals who have the most serious mental illness. So how is APA helping provide services to patients at the community level? The APA uh, recently got a grant, a rather significant grant, from uh, SAMHSA. Uh, and that grant uh, is an educational, developing educational tools for both psychiatrists, other individuals who are working with psychiatric patients, patients themselves, and families. Uh, it's a web-based tool that provides information. Uh, it's, a, it's the uh, Clinical Support Systems Grant. It's a five-year grant. Uh, it is already uh, online in its initial stages. And that is specifically uh, directed at uh, individuals with serious mental illness. So that is a huge step forward. Uh, APA uh, was started by individuals who were superintendents of state hospitals. Uh, so uh, this being the 175th year anniversary, we have a 175 year history of taking care of people with serious mental illness. That includes in institutions and obviously these days much more so in community settings. Yes, it's come a long way. Now how has APA helped you throughout your career? Uh, I think APA has helped me the way it helps uh, many psychiatrists, uh, and one of the major ways is the annual meeting. Uh, psychiatrists are either often uh, practicing in their offices with little opportunity to interface with colleagues, or fighting systems that they would like to see uh, different than they're currently functioning, uh, and that can be a very lonely activity. They come to the AP annual meeting and you get together with like-minded individuals who sometimes your only contacts are year to year to year at the annual meeting. Uh, the second is that the APA is a tremendous source uh, of uh, electronic information, uh, both that it puts out on its own generation and also that you can make a request for information. Uh, we have a revitalized uh, library that is a wonderful source of information. The APA really is the uh, political action operations for all psychiatrists uh, in terms of uh, both the federal level and the state level. Absolutely. All right. Well, Dr. Geller, thank you very much for your time. Appreciate it. You're most welcome. It's been a pleasure chatting with you. Thank you.